mind-blowing, really. Not what I expected at all. I came here, I suppose, expecting system structure, all the left brain stuff. <laughs> I didn't get any of that. <laughs> so it's blown my mind somewhat. I found today magical, absolutely magical. The exercises we did were primordial. They were spontaneous, they were real, and they were powerful. They anchored in the prosperity that you said we would find. And the next step, the things we need to do to manifest, came through so easily. One of the wonderful things about being in your space is the sacredness, the sacredness of the space and the energy with which the messages were delivered. And of course, the strictness to go with it. I was not allowed to take notes because I had to listen with the energy of the workshop. And that was a new experience for me. But I did what I was told and it was perfect. It was absolutely perfect. Utterly surprising and beautiful. I think if you're expecting to come here to do some rational thinking and ironing out uh, little issues that you have think again this is a journey I think that is a wonderful way to reconnect you to your strength what you already know inside to be true uh, to the abundance of life and to joy and uh, when that kind of shift takes place then change happens by itself and you need not do a single thing. And it was just incredible to see magic happening. I mean, there was one moment where I was in my jaw just hit the ground and um, over over one of the um, the colour mirrors bottles um, that someone chose, and it was just just magical, just magical. The messages and the healing that 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 tool can bring out in a group and I mean literally every single person had a transformation and every single person was moved and I think there's also something definitely about the resonance of this space and we've done some powerful energy work and various events in this space there's something very powerful about the resonance it's like the, this is an amplifier and it's a very very healing space to do this work so I feel I feel very pleased actually, and I, I, it just feels like a, a job well done. Yeah, because it really exceeded my expectations. Um, turned up today and met some wonderful people. Um, the first word that comes in is magical. It feels like real magic, alchemy has truly happened here. Um, we spoke about this environment and how. It's kind of set up for that and I think until you experience that deeply you're perhaps thinking mm, not sure not sure but actually yes there's um, real magic happened in this space. Um, what I really love about working with Rachel and these groups in this beautiful home this mansion is that we've developed the way in which Rachel and I can work together and let the whole day flow and rather than have everything structured and um, very organized we've learned how to work with the groups of the people that come and that was especially relevant today we allowed the day to unfold and the issues that needed to be cleared were just perfect it just worked like a dream and uh, the people who came said at the end that they would experienced a great deal of healing and were really really um, bouncing and feeling very optimistic about their own prosperity and also interestingly enough the prosperity of the whole so whilst we've moved into a place of recognizing our own ability to manifest money and to experience a greater level of prosperity we're also appreciating that this is a prosperity that we're creating on a on a global planetary community level too and it feels more like it's to do with all of us rather than just us individually and that's really exciting I mean <laughs> just do it yes because even though if if you'd explained in the marketing what was going to be included then I think there might have been uh, uh, well I know that there'd been a lot of resistance and I wouldn't have come along 
So I'm glad I didn't read it properly, <laughs> to be honest, and just came along. And I've experienced things that I would have resisted absolutely before for stupid reasons. But I've been subjected, shall we say, to things today that that I would never have wanted to experience, but I'm so glad I have now. So just throw, uh, go with gay abandon, throw it all to the wind and go for it. Why not? Life's too short to faff about.